everybody, it's your boy Titanic Feet Jack, and I'm back at you again with another video. I would like to welcome everyone back to the channel. How y'all doing out there? What is going on with you guys? TF Gang, stand up. Anyone out there new watching for the very first time, I would like to welcome you to the channel as well. And if you feel at home and you like the content that you're watching, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Sub up to the channel, guys. We got some good things going on here. Also, turn on your post notification bells so you'll be notified every time I upload a video right here on this channel. And I need everyone that's watching to smash that thumbs up button, smash that like button. It helps the channel grow. YouTube sees those thumbs up and continues to promote the video out on the platform so other people that are not part of the family can see what we have going on here and give them an opportunity to join what we have built thus far. Today, we get getting into a sneaker. You see the box is an orange and white Nike box. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. Grab the box. Y'all see the box label? I'm gonna go ahead and read it. it says Nike Dunk High Retro. Color white, game royal, total orange. Size 14, personal prayer. Price 110 US dollars. Go ahead and pop the top. You see, we do have a lot stamp right here. If you guys can see that. Your regular white tissue paper. And we have the Nike Don't Hide Grand Royals, aka the Kentucky Don'ts. Let's get the other sneaker out of here. Yes, guys. The Nike Don't Hide Kentucky. Let's go in. Yes, guys, we have the Nike Don't Hide Retro, the Royal Blue, or the Kentucky is what we calling them. And it does say retro in the title because these are retro from that Be True to Your School pack that released back in 1985, where you had the Nike Dunks representing the different universities, such as Kentucky, Syracuse, Iowa, UNLV, Georgetown, only to name a couple. So this is a chip off that block from back in 85 with Scoop Jackson and all those guys would that be true to your school pack. How many guys still have those sneakers from that be true to your school pack? Comment down below. I know first person come to mind that may have these is the homie, the OG Jumpman Bostic. He may have those because I'm pretty sure he was collecting back in 85 when everything got started. But getting into the sneaker, you have that roll your blue on your overlays, your swoosh around the ankle, your eye stays, and your mud guards. You have that white colorway around your ankle up here and on your color blocking. You have a two-tone midsole. You have that white with the roll you at the very bottom, which leads to the outsole. All roll your blue outsole. And you can see your Nike branding right here in the middle back of the sneaker you can see the leather quality isn't the best but this is what we're working with in 2021 we got your little bullet tab right here they also did an iteration of this last year with the low top but let me know which one do you prefer this one or the low top that dropped last year leave that down in the comment section looking down on the medial side Continuation from the other side, your royal your blue suits coming from the other side, going around your overlays and your eye stays and that mud guard. You also have that two-tone midsole with the white and the royal your blue at the very bottom. Looking at the toe box, it looks like you got a pickle inside. So that just lets me know I have to take out the tissue. Here you go and stuff this with this tissue right here. And give you a closer look at that leather. It got a real plastic feel, but it is authentic leather. It's just not of the top echelon of leathers that they used on here, but I still like the shoe. You got a nylon tongue. It's breathable, semi-breathable per se. 
and you also have one set of laces. These are the only laces these came with, and these are the new laces they've been using in 2021 on your dunks. It almost feels as comfortable as this t-shirt that I'm wearing, but they got the royal blue laces on here. They're like the, I almost think they're like some type of cotton of some type of nice, smooth, cool fabric on the laces. And you have your woven patch, which is white, and your Nike and Suze branding on here in the royal blue colorway. Looking on the back side of the tongue, more of that nylon material, and you got all that, that mess is going on right here on the back of that tag. Sock liner, cotton, royal blue sock liner. And on the inside, you have a royal blue insert with the orange, Team Orange Nike branding, and you also have a sticker inside there. Let's see, can I get you guys a good look at that sizing tag? Production date, not sure if you can see it, says January 6th to February 19th. So a little over a month of production with these guys. Let me know what your thoughts are on these. And these did come out in grade school sizing as well. Let me know. I also have a grade school pair here. Show you what they look like. This is the grade school sizing these. It's a nice little shoe, guys. So let me know what your thoughts are. And I'm going to roll out here. But before I go, like I always tell y'all, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker because you're that for dope. Excuse me, because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.